And now to Oshun, where the government has launched the state's first ever youth policy document to set a clear direction for youth education, empowerment, engagement and entrepreneurship in the state. A launching the document in Oshubu, Governor Oyetala said his administration has enunciated a clear policy framework to ensure that an enabling environment is created for the youth to realize their creative and productive potentials. Alasuko Miyogumoko completes the story as presented from our studios. The newly unveiled youth policy document, which has four components, the four E's, which comprise empowerment, engagement, entrepreneurship and education, was developed to provide a crucial framework for guiding the state approach to ensuring that a large number of the youths residing in the state are provided with high quality of life. Governor Oyitala revealed that the Oshun Youth Policy contains a commitment by the government, the youth of the state and the society in pursuance of development and growth. I want to also assure all the youth in the state that this new state youth policy vividly captures workable strategy for achieving the youth development plan of the present administration and will do all that is necessary to ensure that in collaboration with other stakeholders, this lofty intention of the policy is made a reality for our team in youth. Commissioner for Youth and Sport, Yamila Wao, said that the newly launched youth policy document would serve as a veritable tool towards the actualization of the lofty programs of the administration to guarantee a better future for the youth. There is the need to protect the present life of these young persons in order to safeguard their future. With this in mind, the government of Oshun State has been striving to ensure that the youth of the state are given various opportunities through education and employment programs at all levels. The Speaker of the State House of Assembly, Timothy Owaye, attributed the conceptualization and unveiling of the policy to the positive manifestation of the all-inclusiveness posture of the governor. We must review our education to inculcate STEM, that is science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, and also encourage technical education and equip our technical schools. It is time we stop churning our graduates without a clear court plan of employment or self-reliance. The president of the Oshun State Chapter of the National Youth Council of Nigeria, Abdulaziz Ismail, lauded the Oyetala-led government for the effort geared towards development. As this document is becoming a reality today, we believe henceforth the state of Oshun Youth will have a specific direction from henceforth. The government described the document as the force and history of the state and expressed confidence in its significance to redefine the social economic fortunes of the young ones. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.